Welcome back, everybody. We are celebrating Tasty Tuesday here on ATL Live with a brand new cocktail bar in Midtown called May Peel. It's a gorgeous, mm. moody spot underneath Hotel Granada. I got to go. I think that's the cocktail I had, Ooh, Ray, yes. the one with the matcha <laughs> in it. Speaking of Ray, she is here with us right now to talk all about this new spot that we need to go check out. Thank you for being yes, here. Yes, thank you for being thank here. You. I'm excited to be here. You know, what's so cool about this is we hear it's got kind of a titanic influenced vibe and we're looking yeah. at the imagery, the setup, and I feel it. I am enmeshed. So <laughs> let's start with the demo here because we really want to talk about what yeah. you're going to be making. So making two cocktails today, today we're going to start with the boot black. And so okay. this is a variation on a sherry cobbler. Okay. So a lot of our drinks are based in really old school classic cocktails, really leaning into tradition mm. and um, just the history of the building. Yeah. Yeah, and that smells amazing. What was of that that you just poured? So this is Pedro Jimenez Sherry. It's like a sweet, mm. rich sherry. I can sherry. smell it. Tastes yeah. a little bit like molasses and yes. uh, dried fruit. Okay, I'm getting the molasses mm -hmm. for yeah. sure. Um, this is a navy rum, so overproof dark rum. This okay. is a little bit of a black currant liqueur. Ooh. Put in here. Sweeten it up. We're gonna add a little bit of, this is a blackberry jam with fresh ginger <sighs> wow. juice mixed into it. Incredible. It's gonna be our sweetener there. I can smell that mint leaf too. Amazing. Mm. And Ray, while you keep going, we yeah. also want to talk to you a little bit about the inspo mm -hmm. for the cocktail bar itself because we know there are some Titanic themes yeah. here. Yeah. The name May Peel means a little something. Can you talk to yeah. us about yes. that? Yes. So um, before the hotel was renovated, it was the Granada Apartments. Mm -hmm. And one of the early, early tenants of the Granada Apartments is Lily May Futrell, who actually survived the Titanic. Wow. So she was one of the individuals that inspired the film, mm -hmm. the part where Rose jumps back onto the ship that was actually inspired by her. Oh, wow. wow. That's amazing. Incredible. And I also understand she was a writer yeah. as well. Yes. So she went on to sort of preserve and celebrate her late husband's legacy by publishing some of the novels that he never got to. And then she actually published some novels of her own. Um, Love that. The most famous of them being uh, The Secretary of Frivolous Affairs, which is where our menu books get their name. Right. They say cocktails and frivolous affairs so on the front of them. You yes. haven't missed a beat. I love this. And you're gonna you're gonna show us another <laughs> demo here. But yes. while you're doing that, walk us through what else, when someone walks into the bar, what else can they expect in that environment yeah. and menu? So it's this kind of dark, moody environment mm -hmm. um, with these really richly painted like dark blue walls. There's sure. lots of like beautiful colors, um, lots of like kind of smooth like R&B music, mm -hmm. yeah. that sort of thing. Yeah. Love that. It's this like really Ooh. lovely place. This is beautiful. We're gonna beautiful. put that one spread in the center. Excellent. That's incredible. My goodness, wow. I love it. Okay, and then you have one more to show us. Yes. And they just told us we only have 45 seconds, so now we're challenging mm -hmm. you, Ray. Okay. Yeah, this is like your, your <laughs> speed bartending. Okay, speed bartending. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, she's throwing All it. All right. But these are some really beautiful drinks, and mm -hmm. I loved the menu because everything really is hyper curated Ooh. and specialized. The yeah, specialized. Yes. The ingredients are mm. really interesting as well. So what's this one you're working on? So this is the yeah. Jack Rose. This is a <laughs> super, super old school cocktail. So good. Um, about 100 years old on this one. So yeah. this is a drink made with Calvados, which is a fancy apple brandy, okay. lemon, and a house-made grenadine. Mm. So super, super simple. You know what's funny? You have two different types of ice back here. That's how specific <laughs> yes. you guys are. Because we wanted to say what makes you guys unique, but look at this. The, the attention to detail and the, the food, the craft, it's incredible. I would Thank also so add much. that I love the Jack Rose name yes. itself. Very so great. Doing what it needs to do. Ooh. Exactly. Perfectly on we time for our wrap. You know, I mean, <laughs> we ain't go, we're not going to leave Ray. you hanging ever. This is okay, everyone, we want to make sure that you know where to find May Peel. So we're yeah. going to pull up the information right there on your screen because they are mm. located in Midtown, right there on West Peachtree Street. So make sure to go check them out. Yeah. All the, uh, you know, if you've missed this, tell somebody. Go to ATLLiveShow.com and get the whole. The whole episode right there. The whole there. shebang. Love yes. it. 